Spēlētājs Oni. Spēlē. Mai sefon. मुझे भी अगर कोई पूछे तो मेरा शो देखे की आपका इंस्पिरेशन कहाँ से आया है वो पिन पॉइंट करना बहुत डिफिकल्ट है क्योंकि अब वो वो क्या है आर्टिस्ट का एंटीना खुला रहता है कहाँ कहाँ से सब जगह से जो इनपुट आते हैं You gather it together and then it pours out on paper, on metal or whatever. So to pinpoint the inspiration, where has come, when has come, is very difficult. Mm. And or misconception, the artist, I am sure Mr. Colty will also agree that people have this misconception that if you are on the beach, on a quiet holiday, then your mind is more busy. It's not that. It's in Bombay, Mumbai, in chaos, it also works. You know. So to where the show is about, it is phenomenal without any. I mean, uh, not even a, a striking. Hai. Number one, aesthetically it is striking, and secondly, so its meaning, hai, jo, jo deep, uh, jo phobias, hai, jo Nisha ji ne jo predict kiya hai, e, ek cheez hai, ek ek naam lene ki, aur dusri cheez hai usko visual content dene ki, which he has managed to do. It is like an abstract term. Sa, koi sa, supposing someone says uh, thought, so thought ko aap kaise depict karenge? So he has taken abstract words hai, aur unko visuals diya hai unhein. So no, that is a फिनोमिनल एबिलिटी टू डू सब पेंटर यही बोलेंगे जो इन्होंने बोला है वही बोले थोड़े से शब्द मेरे अलग होंगे इन्होंने जो किया है उन्होंने कि उनको किसी ने बताया नहीं कि मुझे ये करके उन्होंने उनको लगा कि ये करना चाहिए वो इतने साल करते आए हैं और वो वो जो कर रहे हैं उसमें से वो खुद को व्यक्त कर He's expressing himself. He's not talking about the external world. He's creating his own world. He's not taking it. There's also painting. He's taking it. 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 He's I admire, I admire the artist who has reached 83 years, and he has taken two decades to express himself so beautifully, so artistically, so colorfully, and so poetically about a subject which is less known to the common people. Most of the psychiatrists and others treating people of phobias may know what is this phobia and things like that. But a common person does not know that there are so many varieties of phobia. So we have a phobia of mathematics when you are in the school. Zameen tare per me nikaliya. So like that we can see, even in real life if you see that famous blade runner called Pistorius shot his girlfriend when she was in the bathroom and in the middle of the night thinking that she is a ghost. <laughs> Uh, so uh, a, a murder was done because he was suffering from phobia and she was not suffering from any phobia. So these phobias, when they are not realized, understood, treated and overcome, it can result in the death of so many people and result in other disastrous consequences. So for the people to understand what is a phobia, the artist has taken pains to show so many phobias we don't know about at all. So I have come here with full admiration for a person who is 83 years young. At this age, hardly people work. But he has taken pains to express and particularly a subject which is not commonly known to any. And I, as a policeman, is fascinated with the way he has uh, uh, touched the subject and gone deep into that and give a colorful expression. Maybe a thousand words may not express as much as what one stroke by Mr. Dinsha Mogrelia has expressed. So I've come here to admire and admire, I, I, I've come here to express my uh, salutations to him and I come here to pray to God that he should get many more years to come up with much more varieties of uh, chances. 
so that many more solo exhibitions I'll be uh, participating in. May God bless the artist. Thank you. I'd like to congratulate Mr. Dinsha Mogrelia for his solo attempt to bring out to the people of Mumbai all the different phobias which he has so beautifully uh, put his artistic strokes and depicted not only the fear, that is the thought, but also the emotions which accompany it. If you look at most of the paintings, you can actually see the fear, that is you can see the anxiety, you can see the eyes, you can make out that a person is scared of something. What I would like to tell, yes, phobias are a reality. They are there in every one of us, but most of them may not be disabling. Most of us are scared of some things and we live our life with it. But if we have fears which disrupt our life or because of which I don't perform to the best of my ability, then it needs to be acknowledged. So by doing this painting exhibition and the book launch, I think uh, people will at least be aware that yes, there are phobias, there are various types of phobias. Maybe they can even identify, okay, even I'm scared of maybe taking injections or I'm scared of blood or I'm scared of eating or uh, weight gain, which is so beautifully depicted in the pictures here. So I wish everybody good mental health to lead a phobia-free life and please understand that if there is a fear, there is also a treatment for the fear. So just don't live your life in fear. And I congratulate Mr. Dinsha Mongrelia on this fearless endeavor of his. Thank you. Hindi mein kahun? Okay, it's a very simple appeal. Ekdam simple appeal hai sabhi ke liye. Jahangir Art Gallery aaye. Take a look at all the paintings, all the drawings, all the sketches. And try to understand what the artist has tried to do. He's tried to overcome his own fears. Aap isko ek, ek normal ek exhibition ki tarah dekh sakte ho ya uska aur deeply dekh sakte ho. Magar aake dekhiye ka jarur. 83 years ki mehnat hai, 83 years, 83 saal ki mehnat hai iske andar. And it will be very nice if you can come and see it. My father, Dinsha Mogrelia, will be very happy. And that's all. Please do come and see it. Thank you. So, my name is Hetal Shukla. And I have curated this show called Phobias. And uh, this is a fabulous work by artist Dinsha Mogrelia. He has been working on this work, this series of uh, amazing work not knowing that it will fall into a place for a show like phobia for 60 years so this is his compilation of work for 60 years and he was suffering from some phobias and while he was working as an illustrator in the agency he would sketch something quickly in between two assignments and throw it into the dustbin he would take it back home and finally illustrate it into a picture so 60 years he's been doing that not showing this work ever so this is the first time, first time his, uh, it's his first show at 83 and first time people are getting to see his work. When I saw his work first time, this was almost five years back, five years it's taken to curate this show and uh, the first time I, when I saw it I was completely spellbound and that's when I took a decision that this will happen in Jahangirat Gallery. He himself couldn't believe that it can happen in Jahangirat Gallery and we made it happen. I'm so happy. The, the poster picture has been converted into an installation. So otherwise I'm a sculptor, I do artwork. So I've created this installation for a selfie point. It's all in the mind is the message that I have got from this uh, exhibition. This exhibition also starts with a frame, one frame that he had created called It's All in the Mind. So this artist has suffered from phobias and without taking clinical help, he's come out of the phobias with an understanding that it's only in the mind. So jisko khud ko phobia hai, usko pata nahi chalta, ye sirf dimaag mein hai. But he's actually overcome that. When I heard that story, you know, that's what I'm taking away from the show, that it's all in the mind.